Did you know that Kawa has nothing to do with Afghanistan or the Pashtun belt? It's from the lands of Kashmir. Let that sink in. And another spoiler alert. Kashmiri chai is not really Kashmiri. It's Chinese. Yeah. Anyway, let's go back to Kawa for a minute. Its origins are in Kashmir, yet it has a rich history blended with the Pashtun region. Kawa is a blend of green tea leaves, cardamom, cinnamon, and crushed almonds creating a distinctive flavor that has become synonymous with the Pashtun culinary traditions of Pakistan and Afghanistan. Over the centuries, the aromatic brew was brought beyond the Kashmir Valley through the spice routes. During the era of the infamous spice trade, a huge center of which was the Kashmir Valley. This migration of kava was not merely a geographical transition, but also a cultural exchange. The delightful infusion became a symbol of hospitality and warmth of the Valian Pashtun people, a shared experience that transcended regional boundaries. The connection between kava and the Kissa Khwani Bazaar adds another layer to its narrative. Kissa Khwani Bazaar, translating to Storyteller's Market, was a bustling marketplace located in Peshawar at the crossroads of the ancient Silk Route. This historical market served as a hub for merchants, travelers, and the storytellers who exchanged tales from their diverse journeys. It was within this vibrant bazaar that kava became not only a beverage, but also a part of the shared narratives woven along the Silk Route. The Silk Route, an extensive network of trade routes connecting East and West, played a pivotal role in the exchange of goods, ideas, and culture. As caravans traveled this intricate web of paths, they carried not only silk, but also commodities like spices, including the precious ingredients of kava. The convergence of these routes in regions like Central Asia, Persia, and the Indian subcontinent facilitated the dissemination of kava and its integration into the cultural practices of various communities. In essence, the journey of kava from its origin in Kashmir to the Pashtun lands and its association with the Kissa Khwani Bazaar along the Silk Route reflects the interconnectedness of diverse cultures through trade and storytelling. The aromatic tea with its blend of flavors became a thread weaving through the historical fabric of the regions it touched. Today, kava is popular in many forms worldwide, but the Pashtun belts of Pakistan and Afghanistan have integrated this drink into their daily lives as a center of hospitality, as a daily drink, as an appetizer, and a reminder of how the world is built on shared culture and heritage. Follow our food history series for more.